Not all landslides are the same. They come in different forms, each with its own character and level of danger. The simplest type is a fall. This is exactly what it sounds like, rocks or other debris breaking loose from a steep cliff or slope and falling through the air. You often see this along road cuts or steep mountain faces. The material then collects at the bottom in a pile called talus. While it might seem minor, a rockfall can be deadly for a climber, a hiker, or a car passing below. It's all about being in the wrong place at the wrong time. This is pure, direct gravity at work. Then, you have slides. In this type, a section of earth or rock slips downhill along a distinct surface or plane of weakness. Think of a block of wood sliding down a ramp. There are two main kinds. A rotational slide moves along a curved spoon-shaped surface, causing the top of the block to tilt backward. A translational slide is when the mass moves along a flat planar surface, like a layer of weak rock or clay. These slides can move slowly over days or weeks, or they can fail suddenly. They often leave behind that classic curved scarp at the crown, a telltale sign of instability. Next up are flows, and these are often the most destructive. Flows are when the material becomes saturated with water and moves like a thick, viscous fluid. They are essentially rivers of mud, rock, and debris. A mud flow is composed of finer material, like sand and silt, while a debris flow contains larger rocks and boulders. These flows can travel at incredible speeds down channels and valleys, picking up more material and growing in size as they go. They have immense power, capable of destroying bridges, buildings, and anything else in their path. They are incredibly difficult to outrun. Finally, we have a couple of other types to be aware of. A topple is when a large block of rock pivots or tilts forward and then falls. This is common in areas with vertical columns of rock that have been undercut at the base. And then there's creep, the sneakiest of them all. Creep is the extremely slow, almost imperceptible downhill movement of soil or rock. You can't see it happening in real time, but you can see its effects over years. Tilted trees, fence posts, and retaining walls. It's a sign that the ground is unstable and could be a precursor to a more rapid and dangerous type of landslide.